In today's Your Healthy Family, as we continue to transition to an endemic with COVID, it's a good time to remind you about the importance of having a strong immune system. It protects you from any number of outside invaders, germs, bacteria, viruses, and more. And while vaccines, a healthy diet, and exercise all play a role, so does how clean you keep your teeth and gums. Recently, during the past three years, when immune systems have been decreased, we see issues of rampant periodontal disease contributing to other issues. What other kinds of issues are we talking about exactly? Gum disease can lead to so much more than just cavities or tooth loss. It also links directly to things like... Definitely a higher risk of cardiovascular disease, pulmonary disease, pre-diabetic issues, stroke, another significant one, and it's been conclusively proven to have adverse outcomes on early pregnancy and things like that. If you're wondering exactly how, remember, our mouth is the gateway to our bodies and not just for food. Everybody has bacteria in the mouth, but it's the level of bacteria or the bio burden that, that coexists so that we maintain an equilibrium we're not losing our teeth, we're not developing decay, we're not getting bone loss. When that balance in the mouth is lost, an inflammation and infection take over. The inflammatory products in the mouth and to the bloodstream, and now they become systemic, meaning they go every, to every other organ that's in our body. About 47% of patients 30 and older have some degree of periodontal inflammation and issues in their mouth. And about 70% of adults over 65 have some significant periodontal or inflammatory conditions going on in the mouth. For example, we know over the past 20 years, uh, the US Surgeon General has published studies on the links between periodontal or gum disease and uh, the oral systemic connection, as we call it. In our next story, Dr. Guerra will talk about the systemic problems that begin in the mouth actually preventing other needed medical procedures and the dentist's role in not letting things get to that point. For your healthy family, I'm Ira Cronin. For more stories, head to yourhealthyfamily.com.